Detectives and a forensic team have spent all day gathering evidence at this block of flats in Wally Road. Officers in white suits have been looking for any clues as to what went on here. We've had police cars up here before, you know, um, when there's been domestic disputes and, as I say, fires and things like that, but not to this scale. A shock, we're in a very shock, a bit of a very big shock. I mean, say to a kid, it's a joke. Not un it's not just unbelievable. It's children. I, d I don't know. Just I came here and I asked for this lady, what's happened? She said, I don't know. I don't know anything. Uh, so many times, very noise and uh, fighting, uh, police coming like that. This one flat is so many complaints. It was shortly after 8 o'clock this morning that police were called here. They found two young children unconscious, one of them a four-year-old girl, the other a two-year-old boy. Both were taken to hospital but were pronounced dead a short time later. I didn't even see until I opened the curtains. I couldn't believe it. I just couldn't believe it at all. I mean, we're all... My neighbour was in tears. I just can't... I can't understand what's happened. They're just normal, happy family from what we all saw, you know, the mum was always with them, they were always in the tricycle out on the grass around the side and the dad was all with them, Eva was with them at the church on Saturday doing face painting for a harvest festival, just normal lovely family, the kids seem really happy, well cared for, can't understand how something like this can happen right underneath where you live. I didn't hear anything this morning. Very few details of what happened have so far been released. We do know a 37-year-old man has been arrested. He's understood to be the children's father and detectives tell us inquiries are ongoing. James Webster, Channel M Today.